everybody welcome back in the first video we went ahead and set up our droplet and installed Apache onto it so in this video we are going to install MySQL and PHP so to do that we're going to continue on here we're just going to grab this and paste it into our terminal so copy this grab our terminal hit and paste and enter this one install MySQL. We're just going to say yes. Now we're going to give it a password, so give, give it whatever password you want. And we're going to confirm it. It's still installing. This will take a different amount of time depending on your setup or your computer. So next we're going to go ahead and activate it. So just copy that, paste it in here, and there we go. Next we're going to grab that, paste it in. Ask for a password. And so we're not going to change our root password, so we're going to hit no. Remove on Vermont, excuse me, remove anonymous users. Yes. Disallow root login remotely. Yes. Remove test database and access to it. Yes. Reload privilege tables now. Yes. And we are done with installing MySQL. So next we're going to go ahead and install PHP and since and this is really useful because Laravel 4 requires encrypt and this is going to install encrypt for us. So we're just going to say edit and paste and this is going to install PHP. So we'll wait for that. And next we're just gonna nano into this directory.config and add p index.php to it. So we'll just paste that in. And this is na this is nano. So to actually to work this, we're just gonna use the cursor keys in here and we're gonna go right before index.html, we're just gonna type index.php. Even though it's still it's already in there back here, we're gonna type it in again. So we're going to hit Control O to save it. It's called write out, but that's how you save it. Next we're going to press enter. And then we're going to hit Control X to exit. Okay, next we have modules. As you see here. And we need one module. Now Composer requires curl to install. So you need curl to install Composer. So we're going to just type sudo apt get and then install and finally php uh, php5 dash curl and installing right now now if we want to test our our installation of php we can just go type sudo nano and go into our www root and we're just gonna make a ph info.php file. So PHP. And in here we're just gonna type what it says. So PHP and PHP info. Then close it. Control O to save it, press enter, control X to exit out, and now we need to go ahead and restart our server. Copy this. 
paste it in here, hit enter, wait for it to restart. There we go. Now if we go in here and type this backslash forward slash whatever info dot PHP enter, there we go. So we have PHP version five point three dot ten and that's good enough to run level four. So in the next tutorial, we're gonna go ahead and install PHP my admin for so we can access MySQL graphically. So I'll see you then.